All right, there we go. Because I'm a goddamn idiot, we're going to. Uh, I think I need to head over to the pirates. I go. Oh, she. You know what? If I recall, she sent an elf over to Ardo. So let's let's head over. I thought she sent somebody here. No, I guess not. What the fuck? What is... What the hell is that up there? Okay, hold on. Negotiation. Achieve the trust of... I've learned enough about the ways of the elves to seek to the Storm Sin. Oh, Storm Sin. I'll try. Between the planets. I now accepted by the sons of me. The next let's find out when the planets are here. And the elves are afraid to make any confessions. Alright. So there's storms. Those, that's the storm sentinels, which is actually the clothing that I'm wearing right now. Uh, somebody is making sexy, breathy noises, and it is catching me the fuck off guard. Who the hell? I need to talk to people. Where is that trap? Whatever. <laughs> so you come in peace, then? Uh, I have questions for you. We're just waiting for now until Hook and Sang or some other smart ass comes up with some ideas, you know? Alright. Do you take me for a fool? You must think you're blessed by his cinder. Like this loud air, you know? I don't like werewolves. Wow. <laughs> you're not so bright, you know? Names get you the rope, you know? Go away. Alright, I suppose that's fair. Are you a hot girl? Ah. Uh who is this the wind blows my way? Uh, I mean, What's up? You're all right. Let's chat about something. Yes. Let's spin a few sailor's yarns. Sorry, what? The cowboy over there keeps giving you dirty looks. Uh, I gave him a good walloping, and now he's sitting there scowling at me. But if you don't stick up for yourself, you stay the cabin boy. That's the way of the world. Uh... Crow! What's that I hear? Stop talking about internal matters right now. Do I need to make myself any clearer? Spank her with that hook. No, Captain. How about you talk to me first? I want answers. Oh, shit. What the fuck is happening? Needle Where? letter? Hello. I guess you want nothing to do with me. You're the most straightforward pirate I've ever met. Spinning Jenny. Ahoy, landlubber. What do you want? Ahoy. Uh, fuck you all then. Shit, they run. The strangers, I deal with strangers out the river. Well, wearing an unusual, I understand. I thought those plan was good. Rich, yeah, but especially if I finish the day, it's important, I understand. This cat, we're getting rich, it's more important, ain't it? We're getting around circles, just leave me alone. No, wait a minute, all here is fine, I'm fine, that, but nothing happens. We sit around. We may get a goal. We're quickly waiting patiently about running in blindly. No, that takes no sense. Have a, what the fuck is happening? Greetings. What can you tell me? The elf tribe is prepared to negotiate. Demands? With you. you make it sound like this ridiculous trip was my idea. <coughs> Damn magician. Magician. So what now? I was right. Where is the fellow? I'll smash him. Control yourself. How interesting. Tell me more, Captain. Is. Is that magician here? He won't get away this time. Uh, I'm sorry, you must have misheard me. I said dumb ambition. Of course. That's not what he said. Elven Puff. <laughs> sounds like pussy. We need a whole bale of it. That sounds like that sounds like what it is. I don't know. Very well. We have no intention of buying the Elven Puff at market price. Man, stop saying that. <laughs> uh, we elves have no interest in your little metal discs. The elves here will have no use for your ducats anyway. Ducats, I wasn't expecting an honest deal. In your opinion, what do the elves want? So, felling trees and rattling your savers, just leave. Are you serious? You think the elves will just give us what we want if we leave? That's how it is important to them. And I don't even collecting possessions. Of course. I look forward to the successful completion of these negotiations. Farewell. Alright. 
And you two keep talking like you've lost your damn mind. Alright, I guess I'll just head on. Back Alma. Uh, Treat poison Kara. Back Alma oh, seems actually in the fact that sh she has beads of sweat on her forehead and a red rash on her wrists and around her throat. Huh? I, I was miles away. What happened? This is a person I thought was a dude in the background that looks scary as a lady. Uh... Do you have to? There are enough blabbermouths around here. Um... Why'd I just get, like, a million experience points? I got five, by the way. She's a crackhead. Unless she was imprisoned, I don't know. I can't tell. Let's head back over to the elves. Thank God for fast travel. Thank fucking Christ. I need to be killing all that shit down there, to be real honest, though. So experience points. Hello. Sonia Sala. You spoke with the greedy humans? I did. They, uh... <laughs> I know what they want. That's safe, they agreed? What do you think? I think they really just want the puff. <laughs> what the, the fuck? power and possessions. We'll always want more. That's true. That yeah, seems quite respectable for a pirate, the man of honor. Then give the man as much as he wants. You will find it in a smaller treehouse. I must go back to caring for my tribe. That Ellen Puff. <laughs> Thank you. Man, if this was The Witcher, that would mean exactly what I expect it to mean. <laughs> Elven Puff. Where is this stuff that I need? Oh, it's actually... What the hell? I... What is... Is it over here? They're not that old, but... Here you go. What? Oh, Elven Puff. <laughs> hey, wait. Hotness. Hold on. Sanya Sala, I Are you interested you. in bartering? With pleasure. What would you like? I have nuts and bowstrings, and I would like apples. I. Ah, oh, fuck me. Can I just give you babies instead? Fuck. At least I'm an elf. It's not like I'm doing anything wrong. Uh, what do we got? Points to spend. Uh, still in... Yeah, nothing to spend that shit on right now. What about... Uh, her? Uh-huh. And do that and then keep those up. Um, you know? No, she doesn't need that. Uh... Uh-huh. And, um... And... Fencing weapons. Uh-huh. Let's go over here. Give him... He's all maxed out on that. Alright. Hope that willpower. Doesn't need perception. Doesn't need any of that shit to be real honest. Like, that's fine. Maybe I could... Yeah. And him. Give him willpower, sneak. Fast talk. Human nature. Pick locks. I, I want to learn that. And that's... There we go. Okay. Let's head back over to the Pritz. Uh, I need to get the pick lock skill. I don't know who I learned that from, though. Actually, I have to look that up now I think about it. I don't think none of these pirates teach it to me. Shadow Fox. Yeah, I don't think none of these guys teach it to me. Let me talk to this guy. By the guts! A point here! Stay away from me! Your voice does not match how you look. Praise be to the Twelfth Gods! You have the Elven Puff! <laughs> Hand it over, and we won't waste another day anchored here. Ah, uh, here. Yeah, Visiting these cursed woods again is the last thing I can ever imagine wanting to do. Our paths will not cross here again. You have my word. We better not. And then over the puff. <laughs> Why do I find this funny? I'm such a child. Fuck me. 
Gravethorn, have the crew load the elven puff and cast off. You heard! Load up and cast off! That's right. Get gone. If you attack me, I will kill you. This is way too cutscene. I'm pleased we could deal with this matter sensibly. These elves, you never know. The twelve gods be with you, and thank you. Uh-huh. Get gone. Are you standing in a tree? You know I'm watching? Shit. They're all gone now. You're right, my friend. If we're up to me, scoundrel will suffer the same fate. You do want that to be a little towards us, don't you? For your friend, I don't say in the case you should have done such a was around me. Well, her situation was the most sensible. Nobody had to die. I mean, what the hell? Like, in a situation where you're given the option of not getting hurt or hurting other people, you should always take that. I mean, if you're given no choice, sure, smack bitches around, but if you have the option, come on. Why would you do anything else? Alright, who do I need to talk to? I think I need to talk to her. Hey. You know how to bring peace. <clears throat> and an Erin. I thank you. Yeah. May you and your tribe prosper. It fills me with joy that you have not forgotten your origins so far from the Faisala. Of course not. I just like girls. Your friend is under the influence of what we call Zertabra. Wait. Destructive magic, impelled by the power of the mind. <clears throat> you two are suffering from such magic, although the source is different. Okay, do you need help? Our fates are intertwined. <clears throat> Two streams converge to become a mighty river. If you bring Ardo to us, you will learn everything else from Alari. Uh, all right. My eyes see far. Open your mind, and I will show you the way. Okay. Oh God. Senya Sala. Oh God, you're so cute. Place Ardo on my bed. I cannot sleep mm. in any case. I will not manage to heal him now, but I can keep him alive. His spirit is trapped by a powerful magic that prevents him from waking and constantly saps his vitality. Like us, he's unable to recover his strength through sleep. Those amber eyes, man. Mm. Uh, bad magic. Disturbing dreams are draining our mandra. What? We can no longer sing our magic songs to soothe the pain. Where songs and laughter once filled the air, desolation and torpor now reign. Uh, do you need help? They come from the fallen stones northwest of here. The thing that resides there is not of this world. We have guarded this place for centuries. Oh, well, look your ears, girl. But now girl. the guards are torn from life, and the magical barrier that protects us from fear and weakness is breached. But that also means that you can now go and help Ardo. Okay. How can I do this? The Zertabra is strong in that place and even older than Azalea. <clears throat> But I also hear other music there. Really? Next to a fury that can never be tamed, I also sense a powerful source of healing. I thought she was going to say next to a furry that can never be tamed. I was like, yep, that's what they are. So I can cure it? All right. I have no idea where she wants me to go. Wait, how have I not stood over here? He is knocked the fuck out. Where the hell am I? Do you have stuff you it can teach me? It is good to see you again. Oh my god, you have stuff you can teach me. Uh, Constitution plus one. Elfin silken speech. The spell prevents the victims from analyzing so I just statements too closely. Uh, fast talk. I don't understand. What the hell does this do? Um, okay. Calm body, calm spirit. The spell targets falls into a deep refreshing sleep from which she, she will awake recover from reserve wounds in a short time and this is usable on a friend I've got to learn that because that's good I also got like a sleep of a oh chair in room removes poison or just <coughs> temper in the moon to, that's good wait what 
sleep of a thousand. Target sleeps for the duration of the spell. How much do I need? Ten? That's not good. I'll go ahead and learn that since it won't cost a lot anyways. Ten points is nothing. Alright, um... <coughs> Excuse me. God damn, I'm so sorry. Uh, where is... Oh, I wanted to do that. Uh... Where the fuck is... Is this the one? To recover from his or her wounds in a short time. Second so heals one critical wound. Oh, yes, God, yes. Um, I don't... Let's just max that shit. No. Uh-huh. And, um... Sleep of a thousand sleeps. Uh, let's just max that up. Let's, and, um, I don't care too much about those two. Uh, <coughs> did I level up? No, five. Okay, so. Alright. Let's, oh, shit. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm so sorry. Um, okay, we want, want that there. And I think, oh, what is this? This magician has dissolved the magical matrix of an enchantment or metamorphosis. This is an area effect spell. And status changes petrified and asleep affects all friends and foes within the selected area. Spell duration immediate. So that's, that is a, alright. This is the sleep thing. This is that. And this is poison. Alright. <coughs> there we go. Okay, uh, up here. Yeah, we gotta go up there. Alright, we're... I think we're gonna go for the time being. <coughs> Damn, noise. So, after this recording, I'll look it up and see how I make them use magic. Because she should... Wait a minute. Does she have offensive magic? She doesn't even have offensive magic. No, 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 no. I wanted to see if she has, but she has enough to be able to learn it. I need to go see if I can learn um, her the lightning It is spell. good to see you again. Yeah. Okay. Alchemy. Kumanato. Alright. Now let's go to her spells. That's good. Okay. Alright, now... Ah, oh, shit. I actually... Oh, God. Fuck it. I'm just gonna... Fuck it. I wanna see what she has for trade, too. I keep going back and forth. It is I'm good so to sorry. see you again. What do trade. you need? What do you need? Will you give me those, you give me those shiny discs? I'll give you a few. What do you got? <coughs> oh, st okay, so I can buy the Storm Sentinel stuff. Well, she's got a boot. You got one boot. That's weird. Um, whatever. Okay, now we can carry on. I should go down there and kill all that stuff. But there's probably stuff over here. Who are you? Mm. Elven women. Mm. God damn. Love them elven girls, man. What is all of that? It's a skunk. Fucking skunks. Yeah. Oh, it's dead as hell. Well, alright. There's just deer over there. I need to go over here. It's a lot of wolves. Actually, you know what? That's fine. Cast that, combat will start, and I'm good to go. There we go. 
Yeah, okay. Comfortable with that. Summon that bug. And I can heal wounds, and I have that thing to get rid of wounds, and I think I can cast that on friends. Let's try it on you. <coughs> we'll get rid of one critical wound, I believe. Yeah. And, uh, that's good, that's good. Get rid of their critical wounds. Where am I supposed to be going? Alright. I think I can get rid of regular wounds as well. Good, good. 